Hello, I'm going to do a special little Spongebob unboxing of the specific toy, the Joke Master. Um, I got this at the swap meet two weeks ago, though it was, um, it was on a day where they predicted it was going to be rainy, so there were like only four people <laughs> selling stuff there. Um, and it was like the first time I've been to the swap meet for the longest time, so I thought that swap meets in general were all dying down. So that was like a disappointing <laughs> encounter, first encounter with the swap meet in a while. Um, though I grew up as a swap meet kid, um, my grandma used to sell shoes every day at the swap meet in LA. So, I'm familiar with the swap meet scene, just not as a young adult, <coughs> at the time of 2017. Oh, hold on. Right. <coughs> I got some scissors to open it, but first, you can demo Spongebob saying some jokes. So, there are three buttons, his two eyes and his nose, and... They claim that he has, like, how many jokes? More than 50 jokes in his sound card database. So... Is Patrick happy with the way he looks? Sure! He's tickled pink! <laughs> Why can't seahorses agree on new rules? They always vote nay! <laughs> Why can't seahorses agree on new rules? They always vote nay. Um, I don't know if there's any logic of what sound file to play based on the three buttons. Oh, it says in the back, press his eyes to hear a joke, but press on his nose to repeat a joke. And he has a volume control, which you cannot access unless you open the box. So, let's do the same. Hopefully this is enough. <coughs> the box is still in good condition. And here he is, the joke master, released from his prison. Okay, so that was the lowest value. Here's the highest value. What do Krabby Patties and long hair have in common? They both sit in a bun. Okay. So that was the loudest value. <clears throat> I don't know how that registers through recording. But the next step of the unboxing will include taking part part. We're gonna take this Spongebob apart, like really unbox the Spongebob, see what components are inside, because that's why I bought it, so I can get it inside of <laughs> Spongebob. If this screwdriver works. Oh yeah. Got it. <coughs> So that's one screw down. He is bolted down through four screws, um, and probably five including the battery holder. So I'm going to take off the batteries. This is going well. I just bought this new screwdriver today at Fry's Electronics, specifically for jewelry, but 
most toys do have little tiny screws that accommodates the jewelry screwdriver. <laughs> As for what I'm gonna do with Spongebob, um, I'll probably just take his speakers out and use the speakers, because I like collecting speakers. Um, you will really get to investigate what kind of speakers they put in him. Like, <clears throat> they could be this green speaker. This is like the conventional cheapest speaker you'll find in toys. <coughs> They're like green and tinny. Um, hold on. I don't think I got a clear shot of that. No. But yeah. And two little outputs. <laughs> I am getting the last screw out. <sighs> but it seems a bit stuck there. Yeah, this, this screw is fucked up. Oh my god. Hold on. So this was a bit complicated as the final screw of Spongebob was broken. Like, the screw shape is a bit deformed. Um, and the more I try to unscrew, um, the more it made its shape less accommodating for me to unscrew it. So that was like Spongebob's last resort. Um, to resist being taken apart. But it's okay because I got the other three screws um, out. And it mostly does the job, and I just broke it. <laughs> I just broke the last screw, so the back of Spongebob is now a bit broken on that side, but it doesn't really matter that much. So inside, you will see... Hold on, let me take out any extra parts. Nuts and bolts. Alright. Here's the setup, and the speaker looks much more complex than uh, the speakers I showed earlier. More metal in it, um, yeah. And there's the circuit board. To be honest, I don't know what it all means. But this is nice to know what the insides of SpongeBob looks like. Um, I don't really know what to say. I mean, as long as the wires are together and the batteries are intact, he still speaks. Why did the police arrest Gary? He was found at the scene of the slime. Yeah, I didn't register that joke. Anyway, yeah, that seems to be it. <laughs>